Rescue! Protect! Optimus! The Optimauts and the Snot Sea Cucumber. Does this piece go? Hmm. I think I know. Yeah. Uh, Wazzy, sound the Octo Alert. Aye, aye, Captain. Octomorphs to the HQ. Octonauts, we need to... Whoa! 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 What was that shaking, Captain? It felt like some sort of tremor, Peso. An underwater tremor, to be exact. It's caused when the bottom of the ocean starts to shake. And now, our ship is tilted. Quasi, Tweak, let's get the octopod standing straight again. Hi, Captain. Sure thing, Cap. There's our problem. The shaking damaged one of the octopod legs. No worries, Cap. We'll have the ship fixed faster and you can say bunch of munchy crunchy carrots. Bunch of munch of crunchy. Oh, never mind. <laughs> what be making that strange sound? Look, over there. It's a it's a it's a slimy pink pudding. I'm pretty sure it's a sea cucumber. Ow! 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 <gasps> that rock must have fallen on it during the tremor! Ow! Ow! We're gonna help you, little fella. We need Peso down here, right away! Reporting for medical duty, sir. <laughs> Don't worry, I'm here to help you feel better. <laughs> you want to fix the octopod cap? Thanks, Tweak. This is a type of animal called a sea cucumber. Woo! You really are slippery. So you think my patient is some sort of sea cucumber? It's not sea cucumber, actually. Oh, it's not a sea cucumber? Yes, it is a sea cucumber. It's not, to be exact. Dr. Shellington, either it is a sea cucumber or it's not. It's not. It's not. No, not. It's not. It's snot. Snot. You see how it's covered in slippery, slimy snot? Being covered in slimy snot makes it easy to slip away from anything that tries to catch it. And that's why it's called a snot sea cucumber. Oh, snot sea cucumber. No, I mean, yes, I think. <sighs> it's okay, little Slippy. It doesn't look too bad. I'll just bandage you up and you'll be as good as new. Please hold still, or I won't be able to... No! Come here, pal. Oh. Whoa! Whoa! Oops. Whoa! Slippy? Slippy, are you under here? Hello? Slippy, where are you? <gasps> A trail of slimy snot. Injured snot sea cucumber on the loose. Injured snot sea cucumber on the loose. That's not good, Captain. A snot sea cucumber needs water to breathe. She can't be out of the water for too long. All Octonaut hands on deck. Injured snot sea cucumber on the loose. And her name is Slippy. Whoa! Whoa! A 
the boss, you slimy critter. I'm Ted Quasi. <laughs> <laughs> Munchy, crunchy carrots. Now, our snot sea cucumber was last seen sliding into an octo chute. Hi, she's a slippery one, all right. According to my calculations, we have less than five minutes to get her back into the water so she can breathe. Octonauts, we must find her now. She's probably looking for water, so search in places where there's water. Captain, we're running out of time. Oh no, what are we going to do? Hmm. There's only one thing we can do, Peso. If we can't bring the snot sea cucumber to the ocean, let's bring the ocean to the snot sea cucumber. Huh? We'll flood the octopod. You mean fill it with water? Yeah! Hi there, Captain. It's all fixed. Attention all octonauts. Put on your diving helmets. Opening all hatches. We're flooding the octopod. Yep, faster than you can say. Flood the octopod? In 10 seconds, the octopod will be completely filled with water. Nine. Hang on, Sippy. Eight. Seven. Six. Five, four, three, two, one. Captain, we still can't find Slippy. Whatever she is, she can breathe. But she's still hurt. There has to be somewhere we haven't looked. Right over your head. Over my head? That doesn't make any sense. Maybe not, but there she be, right over your head. Oh, yes. Gently now. We don't want to frighten her again. It's all right, Slippy. We're not going to hurt you. <laughs> <sighs> Gotcha! This won't hurt a bit. Good as new. You should heal nicely. And here's a sticker for being my... my... my slipperiest patient ever. Oh, thank you! Great. Now let's get you back out into the ocean. And the ocean back out of the octopod. Well, at least things are back to normal. Uh, sort of. Yep, Cap. Looks like we'll be picking seaweed out of the ship for a long time. But it was worth it. <laughs> ah. That was the last piece, but there's still one missing. Where could it be? <laughs> Slippy, come on now. That's not the way you play with puzzles. It's not. Well, it's not. Oh, snot. It's not. <laughs> It's all right, Slippy. We're not going to hurt you. Gotcha! This won't hurt a bit. Good as new. You should heal nicely. And here's a sticker for being my... 
my, my slipperiest patient ever. Oh, thank you. Great. Now let's get you back out into the ocean. And the ocean back out of the octopod. Well, at least things are back to normal. Um, sort of. Yep, Cap. Looks like we'll be picking seaweed out of the ship for a long time. But it was worth it. Whoa! Ah. That was the last piece, but there's still one missing. Where could it be? <laughs> oh, oh, my! Whoa. Whoa. Whoa! What was that shaking, Captain? It felt like some sort of tremor, Peso. An underwater tremor, to be exact. It's caused when the bottom of the ocean starts to shake. And now, our ship is tilted. Quasi, Tweak, let's get the octopod standing straight again. Hi, Captain. Sure thing, Cap. There's our problem. The shaking damaged one of the octopod legs. No worries, Cap. We'll have the ship fixed faster and you can say, bunch of munchy, crunchy carrots. Muncher, muncher, crunch it. Oh, never mind. What be making that strange sound? Look, over there. It's a, it's a, it's a slimy pink pudding. I'm pretty sure it's a sea cucumber. Ow, ow, ow. <gasps> that rock must have fallen on it during the tremor. Ow. <gasps> We're gonna help you, little fella. We need Peso down here, right away! Peso reporting for medical duty, sir. Don't worry, I'm here to help you feel better. You wanna fix the octopod cap? Thanks, Tweak. 